welcome this is the energy vibration um, reading for the Pisces Sun Moon and rising and I want to say thank you to all you Pisces out there thank you for the wonderful wonderful energies um, wonderful support that you have been given this channel um, it is so amazing thank you um, you guys you know really 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 super good because um, I'm over my 10,000 viewers and um, I want to say to each and every person out there especially to my subscribers and the subscribers who have been with me for a very long time I want to say thank you I'm going to um, try and make a special that I am um, online because the last time that didn't work but I, I am going to do something special because um, Thanksgiving is coming up and that sort of a thing is coming up so I'll try to do it for Thanksgiving but for you Pisces I don't know thank you <laughs> thank you um, you guys you guys really rock I don't want to use what's their name word but you guys are absolutely really rock um, and you're reading to this week um, your focus is going to be money but it's gonna be good okay this is a week um, oh okay so <laughs> super I'm so grateful for you Pisces I love you guys I love you Pisces so much oh, my god I have so many people in my life that are Pisces in my family who I just so have a good relationship with my mom my grandmother my cousins and I don't know I, I love Pisces people um, okay we need to get in the reading because you have a very beautiful reading and you know this reading is just plain and straight it's all about money it's all about love um, it's good okay the energy vibration of um, the energy vibration of this what is happening here for you guys is wonderful okay this is the third week the week is beginning from the 17th until the 23rd um, the energy of this week is going to be the energy of your um, justice and the energy of justice is working together with the knight of cups so a lot of you little Casanovas out there you know be aware what you're telling the ladies be honest to the ladies this week is the energy vibration from water uh, um, from hair and the zodiac energy vibration from water and uh, fire okay but it's good it's a good good week for you guys because the whole week even though um, it changes on Sunday the whole week it's good it's perfect it's hitting it's rocking everything is working out okay so you know this is good so this week is going to be a powerful week especially for the people 18 and 18 um, to 35 you know it's going to be an extremely powerful week for you guys whatever you want with the materialistic world it's going to be good the ten of Pentacles is here looking over your reading so whoever you are and whoever that is trying to make a good strong um, situation you're realizing how powerful this is and how wonderful this is because you are realizing that each time we do something you are seeing that wonderful new experiences are happening so this is extremely wonderful this is extremely positive these are positive endeavors in your life in, in your life that is coming up okay so as we look at this what we have on Monday we have uh, your wishes and dreams are coming true I love the energy of the nine of cups the nine of cups is a wonderful wonderful energy it doesn't really matter what's really happening um, whatever you have been wishing for whatever you have been dreaming for these situations are really 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 going to work out and these situations are very positive whatever you're wishing for the gifts the affiliate the awareness that people um, find you that people see you um, the, the, the the knowingness that your wishes and dreams are coming true especially in money whatever your monetary situation is whatever your financial situation is whatever you're looking for with money and your wishes and dream about money this is happening for you at this moment and it's going to be extremely wonderful so I want to say to each and every person at this moment 
in your life there are so many positive situations coming in your life there's so many positive energies coming in your life money is going to be surrounding you money is going to from this month of July money is going to be flowing your financial situation is going to be balanced okay as we move forward and we look at Tuesday, it is a fire energy and it is a good fire energy because whatsoever that was blocking your financial situation is now finally cleared up. Whoever or whatsoever energy that was blocking your financial situation is now finally cleared up. The tower has broken down whatever that was there that was blocking your financial situation the tower has blown it up it is off and money is going to start flowing into you money is going to start to just come into you whatever reason whatever situation that was playing whatever negative energies whatever whoever that was blocking your financial situation it is over now people life is about to begin and money is going to come in your life you have that Monday and Tuesday and it's extremely good oh by the way the number nine is your energy vibration the number nine is your energy vibration two four six eight ten no two four six eight nine number nine is your energy vibration three ninety nine three times nine so nine ninety nine three times nine so obviously the universe is calling out to you guys uh, um, to be positive whatever is going on the universe is calling out to you guys to be positive because certain aspects certain situation is happening in your life so whatever that is happening it's going to be extremely positive so whatever you were looking for whatever you were looking about whatever that was happening it's going to be extremely positive crowning your week you have the energy vibration of the queen of pentacles another hurt sign so whatever is happening guys it's going to be good if you partner up with an earth sign person which is a Taurus a Capricorn or a, a, a Virgo it's going to be good there will be a little a little conflict but it's not something that you're going to be fighting and you're going to, you know no that's not it it's going to be something where you feel um, well there will be you be talking about certain aspect okay so what whatsoever is happening it's going to be okay because it's 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 not a quarrel. it's like, like a quarrel, but it's over you know it's a it's, it's nothing heavy it's nothing with a sword it's just with a wands you know you're no but I want this no one that and that sort of a thing okay so but whoever this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is that is going to have an an, an touch your lives uh, whether in a partnership business partnership friendship or whatsoever she is going to be so um, it's, it's, it's going to be so positive she's going to bring in positive energies in your life and no matter what it is because whenever um, these people really they're loyal a hurt sign people are loyal people and whoever because each and every earth sign person has this very aspect of them that they're strong in and some what they're more weaker in but whoever this earth sign person is it's going to be wonderful because she is she is just going to support you govern the weak support you so a lot of people if your parents or your mother is a Capricorn a Virgo or a Taurus connect with her whatever the the difference is whatever the the the, the for scale or whatever is going on whatever the difference is connect with her because it's going to bring you wonderful wonderful success and wonderful luck okay so whatever is going on there the conflict or whatever is going on there just connect with her she's going to clear up everything oh my god i you know the seven let me look and see if it's the ones or the sword because I just saw the seven of wands this is wonderful on Thursday you have the seven of wands which is another fire energy and the seven of wands is protecting you and this is good because the seven of wands comes up and this is a very good thing but you have also the energy of with the seven of ones it's protecting you you're protecting yourself from negative and en en uh, entities and negative influence in your life and 
you know you're trying to walk away from a situation but yet still protecting yourself and this is extremely good so what's the every is happening you're protecting yourself but at the same time you're walking away and you're leaving something behind that no longer serves you but there is a sense of you have to be on point looking at everything that is going on on point looking at everything that is going on be on point and looking at everything that is going on for some reason and this is going to be okay because your spirit guides are watching over you and your spirit guides are protecting you in certain things and 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 certain decisions that you're making and you know that's why I say to people listen to your intuition and you know to know if your intuition is right when you ask uh, are you sure and a quick answer comes up because always if you ask your angels and guides and you know they're like you, you know maybe no that is not your angel and guide okay that is just the energy of a negative entity that is trying to connect with you whenever you speak to your angels and guide directly they give you a yes answer if you said you know did did I really make a yes that's it okay uh, so whatever is going on you're protecting yourself from it and at the same time you're moving yourself away from certain things and protecting yourself at the same time so this is good okay what we have here on Friday we have the two of swords and I love the energy of this two of swords because it's as if you guys are now seeing clarity and this you know this card it this 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 card deck it works just one way it has the negative qualities depends on what is um in between it but this is a positive positive um, um clarity you're seeing clarity the world is opening up to you and and you're seeing clarity to a situation and this is extremely extremely positive okay so whatsoever is going on you're seeing clarity about a situation and it is good you're finally coming to a place and a point in your life and this is good because your money is looking good um the connection that you have with this earth sign person is good you're protecting yourself you're trying to leave something behind and you're protecting yourself from this earth sign person but yet still things are working out Another wonderful card you have a number nine and this is the hermit look within for inner wisdom and with that inner wisdom you're going to um, win whatever is going on okay so look use inner wisdom whatever is going on use inner wisdom and you're going to be victorious and successful okay sometimes there's conflicts and we use our ego because yeah we must be right we must and this no um, when I do that is when I see that people are trying to make uh, um, advantage or take advantage of a situation and I'm like it's over this is it this is my last word and it's over I just clear everything out of my part but and and, and those are the time when you really look at a situation you realize that people are making disadvantage and taking disadvantage of you and that's when you're supposed to just use that sword because that sword the ace of swords have two sides you just cut left right and center and clear out whatever is going on okay and this is going to be good so and when you do that look inside for inner wisdom you're going to be victorious and successful okay so this is good as we look at the last week we have the five of ones in reverse the five of ones in reverse and this is good um, the five of ones in reverse is that the conflict is over so if you had a conflict with the Queen of Pentacles this conflict is over on uh, on Sunday and 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 money is going to because you have the energy of money the six of Pentacles the nine of Pentacles and the ace of Pentacles wherever the situation was with whoever the energy of money and the nine of Pentacles and the ace of Pentacles is too wonderful wonderful gift because whatever the monetary aspect of it was whatever that was going on with your money there is going to come a balance a lot of money are going to be returned to you it's as if um, 
that, you know you pay too much or you pay too much taxes or whatever it is but money is going to return to you money is going to return to you and this money is going to help you so it could be that this Queen of Pentacles is helping you to um, balance out your financial situation and on Sunday you're going to receive some money from her and this is good because it's nice when other people help you with your financial situation whatever it is you're going to realize that you know on Sunday she is going to help you with some money I don't have to ask any question because this message is good for the cards because I've been using the other cards um, for the messages and this is good because what is happening is that you have a situation with the tower a situation with the tower so whatever that was blocking your financial situation there is a situation with the tower and then your nine of cups your wishes and dream is coming true and by going within and using the inner wisdom that you have you are going to just break the tower just by not knowing you're just going to break the tower and you are going to see that here your wishes and dreams are going to come true but you have to go within and find the inner wisdom so that you can accomplish that okay go within find the inner wisdom so that you can accomplish that as we look um, we have the seven of ones and the seven of ones you have the five of ones in reverse so you're protecting yourself and the end to whatever quarrel you had with a king of a queen of Pentacles which is a Taurus a Virgo a Gemini or a Capricorn it is over and now um, you are having clarity to a situation and this is just perfectly fine okay so um, again the seven of pentacles you were protecting yourself and the seven of pentacles and who was there that you were turning your back and protecting yourself is a queen of pentacles but it's okay because the quarrel is over and you're now seeing clarity to a situation so this is extremely extremely good um love love there is there is a strong bond with um, you people who are um, you know coupling up with the the earth sign people the Taurus the Virgo or the Capricorns there is uh, um, a wonderful bond there's also for some people who have a child that is a water sign person um, he is bringing in a lot of love he's he's letting you know I'm so grateful I'm so thankful you know you have been wonderful to me so this is also another scenario that is working here what we also have here is that we have a um, the seven of, of ones and the seven of ones is a profound positive energy that is coming in and with all of this positive energy because you're protecting yourself but yet still you are sending out love so what is happening is that on Thursday and Monday you're going to feel that sort of a love so on Monday you're going to have the love of money because money is coming in extra little gifts extra little gifts and extra things is coming in on Monday so you're going to have the love of the materialistic things and it's okay because we all have that like I have that you have that so and um, what is happening that I love is that whatever conflicts you have with the Queen of Pentacles that is going to be in reverse and that is going to be um, resolve and there is going to you're going to be victorious but money is money it, the week is, is money is what is uh, you know the week the week is uh, all about money and which I never say but on Friday you're going to see clarity to a situation and the whole the world is going to be opening up as if by magic okay so this is a good week for you Pisces people whatever is happening enjoy this week because it's going to be a wonderful powerful week it's going to be a week of wonderful um, exciting things and let's see what you have been with a tribe somebody got this also so whatever it is connect with your tribe and connecting with your tribe is good okay connecting with your tribe is extremely good because um, when that energy of connecting with your tribe comes up that means it is um, 
com um, community belonging be seen and understood by others like mind me like like mind people connection a sense of family and friendship knowing your place in the world the card signal and new affirmation with a group humans are a social creature and we all need to be feel useful or connected to a tribe or a community and this is so because it's true people likes to feel connected people like to feel as if they are you know connecting to other people and this is good as we move forward the last card we have is nature spirit I respect all of nature's element beam and to help provide life on earth and this is good because you know it's the fairies you need to think about nature's creatures all of nature's creatures and um, by stopping the pollution and all of this on this earth you're going to see I respect all of nature's element um, being and help um, preserve life on earth I respect all of nature's element beam and help respect and provide life on earth so this is wonderful this is a wonderful messages and i'm saying namaste until next week